Hello, Microsybe here. Thank you for watching this DJI tutorial. In this video we will show you the best practices when using the DJI Remote Controller, for return to home. DJI drones have simple controls, excellent image transmission, and the power to show us the world as it has never been seen before. The objective of this tutorial, is to teach you about the return to home feature. This illustration from the manual may look a little complicated. But no worries, let us take a closer look. What are the prerequisites of return to home? When the GPS signal strength is greater than 6 bars, and you hear the app say home point recorded. This lets you know, that the return to home point has been set. Please ensure you have the return to home, set before takeoff to ensure your DJI drone returns to you safely. Failure to do so, could result of what is known, as a flyaway. Please take note of your location. There will also be a green age marked on the map which means the home point is set and the return to home function is ready to use. Some users have had accidents after pressing the return to home button, because their drones unexpectedly ascend and crash into something. Therefore, it is essential to understand the logic of the return to home function. Let's have a look at these pictures from the manual, there are two, 20 meters markers mentioned in the pictures. One of the measurements is altitude and the other is horizontal distance. If return to home is triggered below an altitude of 20 meters, the aircraft will automatically ascend to 20 meters, since that is the altitude set by default in the app. The drone can't be controlled during ascension. This parameter can be adjusted in flight control settings, advanced settings, return to home. The default value is 20 meters, but can be modified it according to the situation. Once return to home is pressed, this is what the drone thinks. Master is commanding me to return to home, when the drone receives the return to home command. All right. I'm ascending to the preset, return to home altitude. Note, if the drone is higher than the preset altitude, it will not descend, but stay at the higher altitude. Ok, now I'm adjusting my nose towards my master. I'm on my way back now. And the drone begins the flight to the return to home point. After the drone reaches the return to home point. I'm going to land now. And begins to descend after reaching the home point. What is the 20 meters of horizontal distance? The drone will automatically descend, and land if return to home is triggered when the aircraft flies within, a 20 meter radius of the return home point. When the drone flies within the 20 meter radius of the return to home point, and the return to home button is pressed, the aircraft thinks, master is directing me back to home when receiving the return to home command. I'm in within 20 meters, and I can land now. I do not need to ascend, and the drone descends and lands without turning the nose towards you. Tips. The drone automatically lands when return to home is triggered within a 20 meter radius, but users can operate the control stick to avoid dangers. If the flight altitude is higher than the return to home set altitude, the drone will just turn towards you, and fly to the return to home point. Example, if the return to home altitude is set as 50 meters and the user pushes the throttle stick, the drone will return at the current flight altitude. It is easy to crash into something, so please practice the return to home feature and learn how to use the return to home correctly. Do not operate the control stick when the drone is returning to the home point. Here are some examples of crashes and flyaways while using return to home. Example 1. After pressing return to home button, the drone ascended, and hit an obstacle above it, such as a bridge or tree. Remember that the drone will ascend to the return to home set altitude when return to home is triggered. Example 2. When flying the drone on a mountain. You lose video transmission on your tablet or phone. When pressing the return to home button, the remote controller sounded, but the user could not see the drone in the air, or on the screen. So, the user operated the controller sticks, and the drone was lost. Do not operate the control sticks if you can't see your drone. Just wait patiently for it to return to you. Make sure you record a home point before flying. Example 3, when pressing return to home button, the drone automatically descended into the water. Remember, the drone automatically lands if returned to home is triggered when the drone is within a 20 meter radius of the home point. Unlike in the previous case, use the control sticks to stop the drone from descending. Please remember to set the home point before using return to home and wait patiently during the return. Thank you for watching, and I hope this has been an educational journey for you.